<coughs> Robofreeze has four settings. Off, lenient, strict, and very strict. You should never turn this dial to very strict. Why not, Professor? No problem. Let's see what Robofreeze can do. You seem like good kids. <laughs> now, let's see if he can stop crime. With the bandits causing so much trouble, I could use some help with my police work. Morphle, morph into a police car. Perfect. Be sure to leash your dog. Oh, sorry, officer. Have a good day, young lady. Oh, well, thank you. <laughs> Be careful not to kick the ball into the flowers. <laughs> In my city, you get a ticket. What? But... Ah! Oh, my ball. Oh, no! Something's wrong. Robo Freeze must have been turned to very strict. Look. Wow. You get ticket for walking on grass. I wasn't even walking on the grass. You were going to... What? We have to turn the dial down. Yeah! Aww. Go after it, Morphle. This has to stop. But how? I have an idea. We need Robo Freeze to come to us. Morph into a megaphone. You're getting a ticket. No, Morpho. Phew! You did it, Meland Morpho. Ahem. <laughs> oh no. Maybe two Peter freezes are too much. <laughs> I wonder how the toy dinosaurs are doing, Morphle. Morph into a pterodactyl. Great! You are here to save me! I'm stuck on this island, and it's filled with... ...giant monsters! <laughs> Those aren't monsters! 
characters, they're the toy dinosaurs. No, wait! It will eat you! They're not scary. They are my toys. Professor Rashid's light ray zapped them to life. Wow! Really? Morphle morphed into a T-Rex, too. This is amazing! Now, let's play! Looks a little sick, Morphle. Oh, Mila, Morphle, it's terrible. All the animals have caught the animal flu and have to be taken to the doctor. We can help you, Zookeeper Kenneth. Morphle, morph into an ambulance. Come on in, everybody. You will be feeling better in no time at all. Are you not happy we brought the animals to the doctor, Zookeeper Kenneth? Well, of course. I'm happy about that, Mila, but this afternoon, a lot of people will come to the zoo, but there won't be any animals to show them. Hmm. I think I know what to do about that. Let's go to the zoo. Morphle, morph into a kangaroo. What a great idea, Mila. This might actually work. <gasps> Look, Grandma, a kangaroo. Oh, that's lovely, dear. Let's see what this cage is supposed to have. It says tiger. Hmm, I don't see any tigers. Morphle, morph into a tiger. Oh, there you are. Zookeeper Kenneth. Where is the giraffe? Uh, I think it's up one of the trees. <laughs> it likes to do that, you know. Wow! That was amazing! Monkeys! Hey! Is there anybody home? No elephants. That's strange. Quickly, Morphle. You need to become a monkey. No, an elephant is more important. Do something, Morphle. It says here you're supposed to be a monkey. Did you say elephant? Where is it? What? Morphle, you need to morph into a dolphin. And a lion. Where are the parrots? Can't find the rhino. Are the crocodiles still asleep? Morphle, you need to morph quickly. Oh my! What an amazing animal! 
That's the coolest animal ever! Nice work, Morphle! Everyone. Yay! Today, Morpho and I are going to show you different kinds of shapes. There are different basic shapes. There are circles, squares, triangles, rectangles, and ovals. Morpho, morph into a square. Do you know anything that has the shape of a square? Prison! Yeah, that's a square. Now, morph into an oval. Do you know what object is shaped like an oval? Good one! The body of the submarine is shaped like an oval. And do you know something that has the shape of a rectangle? Shaped like a rectangle. Next up is the triangle. Morph into something that has the shape of a triangle. Pyramid! Wow! <laughs> yeah! A pyramid is shaped like a triangle. And the last one is the circle. to take a look at different feelings. Morphle, what was the last time when you felt really happy? Mm -hmm. <laughs> Ice cream! Yeah, you felt really happy when you had that ice cream. And what was the last time you felt scared? <laughs> we are the ice cream bandits. We steal all the ice cream. Yeah! Bandits scary. Yeah, you were scared when the bandits came to steal your ice cream. And then your ice cream fell on the ground. That must have made you feel very sad. Muffo sad. The next feeling is anger. Muffo feeling very angry. Yeah, you got angry because the bandits ruined your ice cream. <laughs> yeah! <laughs> hey, Mila and Morphle. There is one feeling you didn't cover. Surprise! <laughs> Ice cream! <laughs> Don't worry, madam. I'll have your car fixed in no time. Wait a second. I left my tools at the garage. 
I'm always so forgetful. <laughs> oh, my. But don't worry. I'll tow you there. Great. Wait. You forgot to tow me. Mr. Ajan. Can I play with your Mr. Action action figure too, Morpho? <laughs> Woo! Wee! Wee! <laughs> Mila, Morpho, come take a look at this new magic pet. What's its magic power, Daddy? I'll show you. Shelly Pete, put everything on this counter into your shell. Oops, no, Shelly Pete, that's Morphle. <laughs> put everything back again. That's hard work. I think Shelly Pete is a great magic pet, Daddy. Huh? But where did it go? Mr. Action! Oh no! I think Shelly Pete took Morphle's Mr. Action figure. Don't worry, Morphle. We'll get it back. Morph into a search dog. Hey, Mila and Morphle. Have you seen my electric screwdriver? It was right here. Oh, no. Shelly Pete must have taken it. Follow Shelly Pete's trail, Morphle. <laughs> huh? Huh? Who stole my hammer? It sounds like Shelly Pete has been here too. Ah, Mila, Morpho, I seem to have misplaced my wrench. Have you seen it? We're on the case, Professor Rasheed. Mechanic Joe, can you help me? Sure. First, I would need an electric screwdriver. Uh, hello there. Oh, an electric screwdriver. Just what I needed. Thank you. Now I need a wrench. <gasps> you have a wrench as well? Great! Now I only need a hammer. You wouldn't happen to... You have? Wow! All done. I wouldn't have been able to fix the bus without your help. You are the best magic pet ever. There you are, Shelly Pete. And you have the Mr. Action Action figure. Did you take those other things from people without asking as well? That's not good, Shelly Pete. You should never take things from people without asking first. Great! 
Now let's give back everything else you took. Ah, there is the wrench. Thank you. Now we can get your other leg fixed, car robot. Wonder where that hammer is. It couldn't have just walked away. So you guys had my hammer. Kids these days, always taking whatever they want. You're back. Ah, there they are. Thank you. You know, Shelly Peed, if you will be my magic pet from now on, you can hold all my tools for me, so I won't forget them anymore. Yes, Shelly Peed, you can take that hammer. And Shelly Peed will be a great team mechanic, Joe. Yeah, there's no better magic pet for a forgetful mechanic like myself. Come to think of it, I feel like I forgot something else as well. Hmm, what was it? It's always the same with those mechanics. They just leave you in the middle of nowhere and take all the time in the world to do the simplest of things. How to do it myself. Quake Morphle. Ah, oh no! I hope everything is all right. Oh, Mila! Let's check it out. I wonder where it goes. Let's explore it. Morphle. Morph into a monster truck. It's pretty dark down here. Morphle, morph a big headlight on the roof. All right, let's search the cave. Uh-oh. Hmm, let's go left. Hey. Yeah. Oops, sorry. Hey, Meland Morphle. Say, do you know who made this hole? Nope, we're trying to find that out as well. That's good, because they also took my building materials. We'll keep an eye out for them. Let's go, Morphle. <gasps> Mila, someone created this hole and took the magic pet food. Oh, dear. Let's find that person quickly, Morphle. Look, Morphle, it's the Earth Shark. Don't be scared, Earth Shark. We're not mad. You only took those things to build a home for your family. <laughs> That's so cute. Morphle. Let's help them build a great home. Morph into a crane. Need an extra hand? Enjoy your new home. 
But next time, please just ask if you need any help. And now, I guess we have some holes to fix. I think he wants to help us. Great! Then we'll be done in no time. Okay, this is the last hole. Thanks for all the help, and good luck with your new home. Bye-bye! Let's go get And Morphle, these two monkeys got away again and need to get back to the zoo as soon as possible. Could you take us there? Uh, sure. Morphle, morph into a bigger bus. Thank you so much, Morphle the Bus. And you two need to get back to your rock very quickly. Ice cream now? <laughs> yeah! Mila, Morphle, Sarah and I are late for basketball practice. Can you please drive us there? Please. Okay. Let's go, Morphle. <laughs> You're exactly on time. Thanks to Morphle. Thank you, Morphle. Yeah, thank you. Good luck. <laughs> We're finally at the ice cream truck. Hi, kids. What kind of flavor can I get to you today? Hmm, I think I would like... Mila, Morphle, there you are. Telefox has the magic pet flu and needs to be taken to the hospital. Can you take us there? Aww, we'll get some ice cream afterwards for sure. Okay, let's go. Okay, I'll see you uh, soon. Huh? <laughs> Why did you take us here, M Morphle? Has the hospital moved? Morphle not drive here? Hmm, that must mean Telefox teleported us here when he sneezed. Ah, th th that must be because of the magic pet flu. <sighs> I'm sorry, Morphle. It's okay. <sighs> okay, we need to get to the hospital quickly. Morphle, morph into a flying bus. Box must have wanted to go to a warm place. But not to a hospital. Definitely no hospital here. I've never heard of a hospital underwater. There's no hospital here. But the tree that carries the fuzzy fruit is growing in the jungle. And fuzzy fruit is known to cure magic pet flu. I think I see it. And Dr. Abraham. Dr. Abraham is in the jungle? Uh, hello there. Can I help you with something? Telefox has the magic pet flu and needs some fuzzy fruit to cure him. I think Papa Jungle can help with that, right? I think Tele 
box feels better already. It was very lucky to find you in the jungle, Dr. Abraham. Jungle? <laughs> this is the Garden Papa Jungle Maid, right behind the hospital. I guess you brought us to the hospital after all, Telefox. <laughs> oh, I'm sure they were here. <sighs> Don't worry, kids. I'll get to you, ya ass. Morpho, I want to build the biggest sand castle ever. Aw, there's not enough sand in the sandbox. We should go to the desert. There's lots of sand there. Here we are. Okay, Morphle, let's start digging. But I am getting pretty thirsty. It's so hot out here. are after a treasure. Let's show them how it's done. <laughs> hey, the Sky Pirates want the shell necklace. Hmm, it must be valuable. Get it back, Pirate Phil. Just a shell necklace. But it doesn't matter. If Phil and Maurice want it, they can't have it. <laughs> Look, those oxygen breathers are after a treasure. But we are the number one pirates in the universe. <laughs> Oh, 
no, you don't. Good you right. Sea pirates are the only real pirates. <laughs> Take that back. You were always like this. We will never grow the industry if we don't innovate. How are you deciding who's a real pirate anyway? Your partner doesn't even have a pirate accent. Wow. <sighs> that hurt. Just go home, Morphle, and leave them to their bickering. I have a feeling this goes way deeper than just your shell necklace. You call that a ship? I laugh at your 16th century technology. <laughs> oh, so it's a fist fight you want. <laughs> put up your dukes, put up your dukes. Can we just all... Look, Morphle, there are dinosaurs everywhere. Wow! Ah, Mila and Morphle, what do you think of our new dinosaur park? Dinosaur park? Yes, Professor Rashid and I have transported these dinosaurs to our time. Because everybody likes dinosaurs, am I right, little buddy? You bet! Isn't this dangerous? Nonsense, these are harmless. They don't eat people. Well, that's good. Now, this T-Rex, on the other hand... This doesn't seem very safe. Don't worry. This is the strongest cage in the world. Just don't touch this lever. It controls the door. See? Oh, the lever is stuck. Everybody run! Quickly, Morphle! Morph into a T-Rex as well! The dinosaurs have escaped into the city. If you bring them here, I can send them back to the past as well. All right, let's go, Morphle. Morph into a helicopter. Please stop. This is not a tree! Hmm, it must be hungry. I think we can lure it with a snack. Morph into a robot. Pick up that tree, Morphle. Phew! Huh? Something is happening outside the park. Move over, buddy. Uh oh. He's strong, but not as strong as you, Morphu. Morph into a bulldozer. Now scoop him up, Morphle. Thank 
Thank you, Mila and Morphle. Without you, we would have been in quite a pickle. Outstanding work. But what to do with the park? It looks a little boring without dinosaurs. Well, how about you organize a picnic? Hmm, yes, a picnic. With dinosaurs. <laughs> Dad, you're it, Daddy. Hey, Phoebe. <laughs> I'm going to catch you. We're playing tag. <laughs> You'll never catch me. Come on, Morpho. We can catch her. Hmm? Where are they? Mila, Morphu, come out, come out, wherever you are. Could they be? They are in the bedroom. Hiding under the bed.
was fun! Tag, you're it! You can't catch me! You can't catch me! <laughs> <laughs> Tap my test tubes, help! The Christmas present bandits used my time machine to steal a T-Rex from the past! <laughs> we are no longer the Christmas present bandits. Now, we are the Dino Bandits! Morpho, morph into a police car! <laughs> Not so tough now, eh? Now, this is our city! <laughs> well, boys, welcome back to my city. I think this is quite big enough. Fella, it's so funny to think that one day you will be big and scary. <laughs> <laughs> With this sapper that we stole from Professor Racine, we can turn these animals into giants. <laughs> to have a great day at the zoo, Morpho! Yay! Mila! Morpho! The bandits are zapping all the animals into giants! Oh no! We need to get the zapper back! Morpho! Morph into a superhero! Lion, 
Morpho. Hi, monkey. Let's zap you back to normal. Keeper Kenneth, we're back! Great! But, huh? Oh no! You have become really small. But you're still great animals. <laughs> to pick you up. Let's go. What? Where, where, where are you taking me now? I'm taking Mila to jail. <laughs> Mila! Bicycle! This isn't even a real ticket. Hmm, I really wouldn't want to stay here for a long time. More for happy policemen, more! Shoo! Shoo, I say! Get out of my front yard! What are you doing here, Morpho? What? What are you doing? You very mean to birdies! Morpho, police guard, take you to jail! You can't just take people to jail, Morpho! Oh, no! What? <laughs> that was pretty funny. Oh, man! <laughs> oh, that's great! <laughs> huh? Where have all my tires gone? What? A ticket for littering? Can't be on the grass in the park? Why, I ought to... Morpho, why you did it? Well, I'll be a monkey's uncle. Kids these days. <laughs> That's great. Just great. That was great. <laughs> and you'll always remember... To, to stay, stay out, out of jail. jail. Huh? Morpho? Mila! You're now in jail? <laughs> no, I was never in jail. Police Officer Freeze gave me a tour of the station. Oh. Morpho wanted to free Mila, and Morpho take Van to boost the jail. What? Oh, no. You can't just take people to jail, Morpho. <laughs> I had a great time with our little red friend. <laughs> there it is. 
the most awesome roller coaster ever! It has loops, awesome turns, and it goes really high! The only problem is... You gotta be this tall to ride it! I might know a certain professor who could help us with that. This will change you into a grown-up. But are you sure you want to do this, Mila? Absolutely. Well then, here it goes. Mila, is that you? Oh, no. I'm Mila's aunt. <laughs> wow, you look so similar. Anyways, you're tall enough. Enjoy the ride. Anything I want. Grown up? Come, Morphle. Who wants to ride the dolphin? Me, 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 me. I do. I'm sorry, Miss, but you are way too big to ride this dolphin. Pretend to be a teacher, Morphle. I'm sorry, miss, but you're not allowed inside. I'm Mila's aunt. Ah, I heard you were in town. Nice to meet you. Uh, but Mila isn't here, and I have to get back to class now. Goodbye. <sighs> Being an adult is starting to become very boring. This is a children's playground, miss. I'm going to have to fine you. Oh, I'm sorry, but I cannot pay this. I don't have any money. Then I suggest you get a job. Anymore. Are you sure you want to be a little kid again? I've never been so sure in my life. Become big again to ride it? No way! Being a grown up was not as much fun as I thought. I'm going to enjoy being a little kid for as long as I can. Tag, you're it! <laughs> <laughs> oh, get back here! <laughs> 